Um, hey guys, so I did this right here. Michelle Fawn, I think her name is. I'm probably saying that with a little Spanishness, but it's make your own pore strips. And basically you took um, gelatin and milk and you mixed it together with heat and you got this. I don't know if you could see it. And I'm just waiting for it to dry. So yeah, this is an experiment to see if it works as well as the pore strips, which I rely on a lot. So um, yeah, tell you if it works later. Bye guys. Um, hey guys. So this is just going to be a follow up to the little part you saw that I did yesterday about the homemade pore strips. Um, I think it did really well um, compared to the 9.99 Biore strips. They did the exact same thing. And I mean the only downfall was that putting it on it smelled like throw up. And that was pretty horrible. Nobody nowhere said it would smell like throw up. But um, once you get over the initial smell. It did the same job and the gelatin was 159 and I had milk in my refrigerator. So thank you Michelle Fawn, I think her name is. Uh, yeah, thank you for putting up that video. Bye guys.